Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's me, Jake the Happy Snaker, and welcome to part 15 of my Pokemon Fire Red walkthrough. In the last part, I went through Route 8, and I ended up here in Saladon City, and I got my fifth team member, which was an Eevee, and I evolved it immediately after I got it into a Vaporeon. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, and also, uh, Ivysaur is gonna actually evolve in this part. Um, I kind of forgot that I evolved level 31. This is my second attempt. This is my second attempt making this video because I screwed up in the in the first um in my first attempt. The, the commentary was terrible and yeah, so I just start started over again. But um yeah, I, I got Ivy Struck level 32 and then it started to evolve. I'm like, wait, what? Um, because I know that I knew there was some Kanto starter that that, that evolved at in, at level 32, but I, for some reason I didn't think it was Ivy Sword. But yeah, of course it's Ivy Sword. Like, uh, it seems like a lot of the grass type starters. Evolve at early levels. Um, but anyways, enough about the starter Pokemon. Uh, let's get back with uh, the walkthrough. Um, but yeah, we're gonna put Danny up. Actually, no, Isaac. Uh, you know what? Uh, Isaac. Yeah, I'm debating whether I should use red candies or not. Yeah, we'll use one, I guess. Actually, no, we're gonna use two because I'm pretty sure once he gets to level 30, he gets um, he learns bite. So yeah, we're gonna use. Um, I actually lied. I said that we're gonna use two, even though we actually had to use three. But who cares? Um, uh, anyways, you're gonna learn bite. Yes, we're gonna use bite, of course. Get rid of growl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Um, all right. So here we go. Um, let's take on these trainers. There's a bunch of them. I'm not even joking. There's like a bunch of trainers. <coughs> Excuse me. One second. Thank goodness for water. Anyways, yeah, I was choking for some reason. I have no idea why. Um, anyways, yeah, kind of embarrassing. <laughs> I mean, moving on, um, yeah, level 30, yeah! Anyways, Weaving Bell, get out of here. Peace out, bro. Alright, uh, and another freak. I don't know who you are or what you are, but I'm gonna kill you right now. So, yeah, get out of here. Um, yeah, the, there, there is a lot of trainers in this gym, but the one thing I don't like is that they have a lot of Pokemon. So, like, why, like, yeah, it's okay if you have a lot of trainers, but can't you make them have, like, not, like, that many Pokemon? Like, why do you have to make them have, like, a crap load of Pokemon? Like, seriously, it's really annoying. I, I I don't like it, but yeah. Uh, see, look, this chick has five freaking Pokemon. Like, what the heck, bro? Level thirty-one, yay! Oddish. Um, we're gonna go over to Jake and evolve it. Um, since it evolves to level thirty-two, and you're gonna use Stun Spore. That's epic, isn't it? That's just awesome. All right, I wanna kill you. Come on, seriously, give it up, Jake. Stop being paralyzed. Oh my gosh, that's three times in a row. All right, thank you. Holy mackerel. Um, alright. What? So, come on! Are you serious right now? Come on. Die. Die. I'm gonna keep saying die until you do die. Die, 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 die. Yes! Sweet. Weaving Bell. No. Yes. Die. Get out of here. Why did I say no and then yes? I'm like, no. Yes. Anyways, I'm an idiot. Alright. Uh, tackle to the face! Um, no. Die. Get out of here. I hate you. Die. 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 Seriously, give it up. Just die already. What is wrong with you? Um, I have used to need to stop getting paralyzed. Thank you. Level 32, yay, that means evolution. Now you have an Ivy Sword of your own, so yeah, I'll show you how awesome my Ivy Sword is. <laughs> Mine's still 10 levels higher than yours, and mine's gonna evolve soon, so take that, bro. Anyways, moving right along here. Um, okay, you can, you can die. We're so close. Uh, there we go. Death! And evolution! Yeah. Well, it's evolving. I'm gonna take a drink of water. Oh, man. Okay, good. Anyways. There we go. Oh, we got ourselves a Venusaur! Yeah. Like I said before, before earlier, in the, earlier in this part, this is my second attempt making this video, and then I was, like, battling all these retards, and then... My Ivysaur randomly evolved. I'm like, wait, what? Because I kind of evol I forgot that it evolved so so um early. But there we go. We got a um, Venusaur. So yeah, final evolution. Really awesome. Didn't think it would happen so quick, actually. So the only evolution we have left are Pidgeotto and Lily. So yeah, all we have left is Danny and Lily. So yeah, um, that's pretty awesome. But anyways, let's go over to Connor, I guess. Or actually, let's go ahead and head with Isaac since we haven't used Isaac yet in a battle. So yeah. But anyways, moving right along here, oh, I'm gonna kill you with a bite! Get out of here! Oh, yes! One hit KO! Thank you! 
Thank you. Thank goodness for critical hits. Wow, that actually wasn't even a critical hit, and we still took you out one hit. So, yeah, Isaac is going to be a really good Pokemon, I ha I I'm going to say. Um, oh, a Bobble Store. Well, I got a Venusaur, so yeah, yeah, take that. Never mind, you just put me to sleep. That's, that's, that's great, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I don't care, your Razor Leaf is literally doing nothing to me. Even though it is super effective, it's doing nothing. And you have an Ivysaur. Okay, quick attack. Well, I, I got a Venusaur, which is still better. And Poison Powder. Yeah, poison me all you want. Um, wait a second, I think you're going to kill me, dang it. Oh, come on. Ugh. Come on. Kill him, Lily. I hate you. Um, double slap. Die. Freak, get out of my face. What is wrong with you? Wake up! Wake up, wake up, thank you. Die. Level 31, yeah! Alright, Tina, that's a weird name. Oh, uh, anyways, moving on here, um... We got two more, man, there's a lot of trainers in this gym. Um, wing attack, die. Bloom, yes, wing attack, die. Critical hit, I didn't, I didn't need it, but who cares? One more! Alright. And execute, wing attack, die. Oh my goodness, you didn't die? What? Alright, anyways, that's all you have is always an execute. Yeah, oh yeah, I'm gonna come into this gym and I'm gonna beat trainers with a freaking execute. Yeah, that's a, that's a good strategy. But anyways, we're gonna go heal. Then we're gonna take on Erica, the gym leader of the gym. If I can find the Pokemon Center. Um. Yeah, let's heal, baby. Let's heal! Anyways, uh, oh yeah, I should mention you need a Pokemon that knows cut to get in this gym. Uh, I think it's a little late to mention that. But yeah, you need a Pokemon that knows cut and you have an item? What? Cherry berry? Wait, does he have pickup? Yes, he does. Sweet, pickup's a really good um, ability. You can pick up items. Like, you can pick up really rare items. Like, one time I think a Pokemon, found, um, one of my Pokemon found a Max Revive. So yeah, I can pick, I can find really good items. So yeah, definitely, um, Pokemon with, with the ability pickup is really good. But anyways, all right, time to go fight the gym. Yeah, I think it looks pretty cool here. We have this weird looking chick. We have Erica, the gym leader. We have this other weird looking chick, and then we have me, um, who is not a weird looking chick. So yeah, um, anyways, let's go ahead and fight the gym leader. Alright guys, I am back, and yeah, sorry about that, I had to stop making the video for 16 hours. Uh, now, I can explain why I stopped the video for 16 hours. Well, I, rec I recorded the first 7 minutes of this part on Wednesday night, and then I'm recording the last few minutes on Thursday afternoon. And, uh, the reason why I stopped is because my computer, as you guys should know, is terrible, it overheats non-stop every time I make a video, uh, it, it, it starts to overheat and then eventually shuts down. Um, so he was doing that and then, um, and then in like 20 minutes or something, um, my favorite television show, uh, was coming on, which was Survivor. That is my favorite television show and if you guys like that show, that's awesome because I love that show. But anyways, why am I talking about my favorite television show? Let's get on with this! Um, but yeah, anyways. Uh, so yeah, I stopped making this video for 16 hours, that could be a record for me for the longest, uh, break for making a video. But anyways, actually most people don't even get breaks when they make videos, so, um, yeah, anyways, we're gonna start this gym battle, um, I guess we'll start things off with Isaac, and yeah, let's do this. What's up, Erica? Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? So pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome, my name is Erica, I'm the leader of Sodom Gym. I am a student of Art, Flower, and Raging. The Pokemon are so like grass types. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea you wanted to challenge me. But, well, I shall not win. I mean, lose. <laughs> um, yeah, she's gonna lose because I have a freaking Pidgeotto, so... Yeah, say your prayers, Erica. Anyways, she got three Pokemon. Uh, her first one is a Victory Bell, a level 29. Um, and yes, you guys are probably wondering why the heck am I going in with Isaac? Well, um... I have a strategy, and that strategy is called using super potions over and over and over again. And yes, stun support, I don't care, because I have quick attack, and uh, you guys should all know, if you're a, a long-time Pokemon fan, that you should know that um, every time you get paralyzed, then every time a Pokemon gets paralyzed, it, it automatically is slower than the uh, other Pokemon. Um, I think if you're like a... What? Come on! I think if you're like a really high... I think if you're like a really high-leveled um, facing really, really low level, and you get paralyzed, it, you might be faster, but, you know, thank goodness I have quick attack, so yeah, here's my strategy. Quick attack over and over, and that did absolutely nothing, and it's gonna keep doing nothing if she, if she keeps using Giga Drain, so I pretty much got no chance. So let's switch out over here to Jake. Um, yeah, my newly evolved Ivysaur. Uh, I feel like this is a new part, but it isn't, it's, it's the same part as the first seven minutes that I recorded 16 freaking hours ago. 
Anyways, yes, tackle. Uh, and that was a critical hit, which didn't do a whole lot. Um, yeah, paralyzed me. I don't. Will sleep how to work? I hope it will. Uh, I'm paralyzed. Yay. Okay, work. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, I wasn't sure since it's poison type if it, would, if it would work, but yeah, it did. So that's great. All right. Um, die, 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 and she's gonna heal. Uh, all right. Okay, seriously, give it up. Die. Okay, die. Oh my goodness, I'm almost dead. Okay. All right, super potion. Yeah, I almost I almost said a super potion to the face. I don't even know how that would make sense. But yeah. Anyways, um, peace out, bro. Oh my gosh, no! Ugh, stupid. Oh, I hate you. Okay, fine. No, Connor. Yeah, take this guy out. I can't believe you took out my Venusaur. My Ven like, come on. Like, Venus was just a ball. Like, give it a break. Seriously, like, what is wrong with you? Anyways, oh my goodness, almost dead. And stun spore. All right. I wasn't gonna speed through this battle, but since this is taking so freaking long. I thought I should. Um, okay, give your drain. That's gonna do absolutely nothing. Wow, that did more than what I expected. And I'm a level higher than you. What? No! Um, okay, I need a drink of water. If you guys are wondering what, what this noise is, it's my bottle cracking. And this isn't even my bottle. Actually, I wanna tell you something. I came up with a new invention. It's really, it's a really good idea. Poke a hole in the top of a water bottle, in the lid of a water bottle. And, it, like, water will squirt out in your mouth, and it's actually really awesome. It's better than just taking the lid off. My sister loves the idea, and, uh, yeah, that's just a cool little thing that I made, uh, that I came up with. But anyways, BOOM! Get out of here! Stupid victory bell. Um, alright. Tangela is next! Alright. Here's my secret weapon! Take this, buddy! Get the heck out of my face! Uh, anyways, Danny... And I noticed my computer is not overheating, and I think it's because I am not, um, super speeding. I noticed when my computer, when I super speed, my computer starts to get really hot, and then it shuts down. But thank goodness it hasn't shut down during this walkthrough, which is really, really awesome. Anyways, Wing Attack did not kill you, and you're going to use freaking Ingrain. Um, that's great, and what, you're only level 24? I thought Tangela was her highest level, but I guess I was wrong. Okay, then, alright, fine, fine. Bam, you're done, see ya. Dean Tangela, you were actually a lot easier than Victory Bell, because Victory Bell took out my Venusaur! I can't believe that, like, my goodness. Anyways, we are almost level 32, and I guess we'll stay in since, uh, I kind of want to stay in, I guess, that's kind of the reason. I don't know, there's really no reason, but anyways, uh, Wing Attack, yeah. Alright, this won't kill it, because it's level 29, um, and, yeah, and Stun's more, uh, I don't care. Uh, I might switch over to Aerial Ace after this, like, uh, hopefully... Um, uh, I could use Quick Attack, which will, which will make me hit first, but, um, it's not gonna do a whole lot, so I'm gonna go over to an Aerial Ace. Please die, please die, please die, please, yeah! There we go, we just took it, leader Erica. So that's what I like. Jakey likey. Anyways, level 32, so that's awesome. And, player defeating leader Erica. Oh, I can take it, babe! You are remarkably strong! I must confer on you the Rainbow Badge! Rainbow Badge? You guys might know what I'm gonna say about this. Are you gay? Like, seriously? Ra Rainbow Badge. Are you freaking serious? Okay, anyways, T39, that's Giga Drain. I'm almost positive. It is indeed. So I've been teaching that to my uh, Venusaur, and I'm almost, I'm almost positive that somehow Arbok can learn Giga Drain. Um, I could be wrong, but for some reason I have a really good feeling that Arbok can learn it. It can! Man, I'm smart. Alright, well anyways, um, I'm not teaching to Arbok. However, that'd be a good move on gr on ground type mo um, on ground type Pokemon, so I might teach it to Arbok. Because then it'll take out ground ground type Pokemon pretty easily. So I don't know, to be honest. Uh maybe we'll get rid of bullet well it only has five PP, wow. Okay, um, I guess we could, uh, maybe I won't even get rid of a move, considering that actually Gigatrain has the most power out of any of my moves here. Um, I'm gonna get rid of, um, Sleep Pack. I don't think I want to get rid of any of the moves, because Bolt is pretty decent. Um, Razor Leaf's okay. I don't know, actually. Maybe we'll just, uh, maybe I'm not, I I'm gonna keep Gigatrain. I might teach it to Arbok. We'll see. But anyways, let's take a look at our new badge. There it is. Yes, then we have half of the Kanto badges. The last four will not be hard at all. Um, but anyways, yeah. So, let's cut and get out of here. And then we're going to put me off in the PC because we don't need that piece of crap. Technically, it's not crap because it's actually, um, it can cut trees down. So, yeah. 
But anyways, um, there we go. Yeah. Um. All right, move Pokemon. Um. Meow, move. All right. Anyways, there we are done. So thanks guys for watching. In the next part, I'm gonna go. Well, in the next part, I'm not gonna say where I'm gonna go, but I'll give you a hint. As you can see, I'm on, I'm on, I'm on my bicycle. So yeah, see if you guys can guess what I'm gonna do in the next part. Um. So yeah. No, okay, you know what? I'm gonna go to Cycling Road. I don't care. I'll just spoil it for you all. I'm gonna go to Cycling Road in the next part, so just stay tuned for that. Thanks guys for watching. God bless you all. And I'll oh yeah, I'm also gonna get HM Fly as well. So yeah. But thanks guys for watching. God bless you all. And I'll see you all in the next part. Adios.